Last week, we showed you how to turn your bedroom into a mini photo studio with items you have around the house. In this video, we're going to take that idea to the next level. Do the, maybe that Mario sound. Do it like that. In this video, we're going to take that idea to the next level. I feel so uncomfortable. Leave all of this in there. We're going to show you how you can transform the standard walls of your house into a visually striking backdrop. We'll use a newspaper, but you could also use similar items like magazines or toilet paper. Wait, we better save that. We've seen this done before on Instagram, but we're going to try to bring our own unique style to it. Here we go. Since we like shooting with wide angle lenses, we need to make sure we get as much newspaper coverage on the wall and floor as possible. Speaking of, <clears throat> speaking of wide angle lenses, we'll be shooting this whole thing with a 35 millimeter lens. Since there's not always an extra photographer in your home, you can also set your camera on a timer or use an app to trigger your camera, like we did here. To bring something a little different to the table, we're going to use a projector to shine words onto Rachel. We also wanted to use a prism and it worked out pretty well. Until it didn't. We hope this inspires you to get creative at home. And Give them a hashtag. What's the hashtag? Mango Street at home? Mango Street Quarantine. And if you do want to try this challenge out for yourself, use the hashtag Mango Street Quarantine when you post to social media so we can check them out. Like this video, subscribe if you haven't already, wash your hands, and we'll see you next week.